What's up everyone, this is Quiz Guru here, and we're back with Radiant Historia. We're back at the Alma Mine, we're about to take a new pathway. Because apparently the first pathway I took was uh, the wrong one. Got everybody killed, no big deal. Uh, we can skip all this because we've seen this. What I like about this game is that uh, instead of showing you like the events that, that transpire, it just gives you a description. Hey, you fucked up. Now here's a 10 second explanation as to why you fucked up. Before, I waited in ambush, and that got us killed, so we're gonna send scouts. Yes, I should send scouts. No, an ambush would be too time consuming. Perhaps we should... Okay. Guys, I already know this is the right path. Ugh. Well, Stock, it looks like you're in between a rock and a hard place. You two. That means we have something to tell you. We feel the presence of the Chronicle, one who wields the same power as you. Uh-oh. What do you mean? Are you telling me there's another Chronicle? That's right. There is. It's called the Black Chronicle. Haha. <laughs> I get it. Black, white, huh? So it's the opposite of mine. And someone else out there is wielding it just like I do. That's right, and its owner is throwing this history into disarray. What? How is that possible? Well, the Black Chronicle grants the same special power, and it's being used to cause harm to you. But why? What's the angle? You don't know, do you? Yeah, you don't know shit. You mean to tell me that even the residents of Historia are blind to something? It's not as though we're omnipotent beings. We can't see into the hearts of the wielders of the Chronicles. Let's see. Well, let's take a step back here. Our mission is at a standstill because the explosives were never delivered. You're telling me that this is all doing. This is all the doing of whoever wields the Black Chronicle? Correct. The merchant was killed by the owner of the other chronicle. And in doing so, history has been misaligned. What can I do then? Should I go back in time? Well, yes and no. To be precise, you would need to go back in time in the other history. Because sometimes, even going back in time isn't enough to solve the problem. And when that's the case, you can resort to going back to the other history's timeline. The two histories are bound to the same world. The hearts and minds of its people are shared. Thus, the actions we take in one time reverberate in the other. Take the merchant, for example. He was killed in the other history, and now his death is affecting the true history. So what you're saying is, if I save him in the other history, he'll be alive in this one. And that would mean the explosives would get delivered. Am I right on track here? Correct. You've just spoken to the informant. After that, he moved somewhere else. This action must be affecting the other history. You should search for incidents in the other history that may be linked to this situation, especially if you are scheduled to meet him. You have to pay close attention to detail. Oh, I'm good at attention to detail, that's why I'm gonna rock this game. Alright, I'll give it a shot. You're sure to find yourself in similar situations from here on out. The present and the past. Two timelines. You will pass between them as necessary. In order to guide history in the right decision in the right direction. I have a fan I have a feeling that will keep me busy. Don't worry, I'm sure you'll manage. Well, until we meet again. Sergeant Stock, sir? Hey, what are you mumbling about? Er, it's nothing. Don't mind me. Well, if you were figuring out a way to get a hoard of those explosives, keep going. Just try not to scare my men when you do. So, got any ideas? No, not yet. Breaking Rocks has been added as an event. Cool. So, well, since we're here, let's take Gander around, see if we can get any goodies. 
I know I am running, but I feel like I should be able to run faster. Oh, I can go inside. Oh, chest. Mine! Seen the bomb. Uh, what's up here? Yeah, there's that chest. I knew there was a chest. Oh, goody. 200 golds. Let's go to Historia, guys! We went into the book. Alright, let's take a look at this White Chronicle. So we can't go forward. It's impossible to go forward. But, we can go back here. Yes. We'll go here and make a new decision. And of course we have to skip all this dialogue. So, if I know correctly then we should go th this way. Think. That is not accessible. Maybe I'm supposed to talk to him and then tell him fuck off. Damn it! I'm back. I'm going to stay under heist. Sorry. But I'm gonna get I'm going to continue working under heist. See, I'm disappointed, but it's your choice. To be honest, I really could have used your support. I want you on my team, Stock. But if that's the path you choose, I'll respect your decision. Good luck, buddy. I'll be waiting for your return. I bet he has the Black Chronicle. He's being way too nice. I don't know where to go from here. I've been waiting for you, Stock. What's the matter? You look like there's something on your mind. It's nothing. Oh, alright then. To business! The job this time is to apprehend a certain person. You're still convalescing, but it shouldn't be a challenge. A certain person, eh? Who is it we're talking about? His name is Vlad. He's the leader of a rebel faction who opposes the Prophet Noah. A rebel faction? General Hugo requested this, didn't he? Everyone in Alistil is at the back and call of the Prophet. <laughs> a man in my position has nothing to say about that, but it's true, the f faith in the, no in the prophet Noah is the fuel that drives this nation, and, if, and we can call ill effort, <sighs> and we can call ill afford. I am bad at reading. And we can ill afford to contone anyone who'd throw a wrench into the work. Does that not satisfy you? No, that's fine. Tell me more about this, Vlad. We haven't found out what he looks like yet, but we do know something of his movements. Said some bait, have ya? There's nothing special, as the rebel factions go. From what I've heard, there's a similar resistance in Gnorg. Theirs seem to be giving them a great deal of trouble. Ours, on the other hand, poses little threat. They fall quickly into our traps. So where am I headed? Start? At the item store in the first ward. The owner there is one of my informants. Find out anything he knows about Vlad and take whatever measures you deem appropriate. You want me to capture him, but not kill him. They mean very little in the greater scheme of things, but we can learn much from them. Understood, I'll begin at once. Don't really know where I'm supposed to go. Why is this... How am I supposed to go forward in this? What is this? What is this option here? I know there's something here. Is it another ending? Is it like a banning? Is it something that happens if I choose to like just piss around? We don't have any party members right now. Was it raining before? Hmm. Okay. So something about going to the item shop. That's the end. That's the item shop. So I think there's the informant in here. He does Oh! Here we go! There we go! Swordsman in red, you must be stuck. I told me you'd come around. And here I am. Tell me what you know about Vlad, and I'll take it from there. Vlad should, sh should soon show his face at the bar in the second ward. How will I know him? Oh, he's hard to miss. He always wears a robe. In this weather, I doubt the bar will have many patrons. Once he shows up, you should be able to spot him right away. Alright, I'll be on the lookout for a robed man. Let's go... I think it's the bar? Not the inn, but the bar. He said the second ward, which I think is up here. Let's see. Pop, 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 pop. Alcohol. Here we go. 
Oh, there's the informant. Barkeep, I'm here for the goods. What goods are these? The offering to the Prophet? Oh yes, that. I have it right over here. Sorry to trouble you, Barkeep. Make sure you don't open that until you're back home. Absolutely. Until next time, then. By all means, come again. So that's him. Amateurs, no subtlety at all. We better not make a scene here and here. We'll do this outside. Alright, let's follow him. I mean, where the fuck- oh, there he is. Hello. Something you need, friend? Are you Vlad? What's it to you if I am? Well, his name just changed to Vlad, so I guess he is Vlad. I wondered why you were dressed differently than your average soldier. You're a spacious hatchet man. Dedicated to your work, I see. Shut up. Don't you ever get to wondering? Take the prophet Noah's guidance, and is General Hugo still giving the people the truth? It's been five years since the prophet's been seen in public. What's he doing with himself? I couldn't care less. My mission is to apprehend you, and that's what I tend to do. Such obedience. More like a lapdog than a rat terrier. If there's one thing I hate about dogs like you, it's all the blind loyalty. I told you once to shut up. And if I don't, I will stick my sword into your throat. Sorry, but I won't be hounded to my grave. Oh, we're gonna fight this guy, really? He doesn't look very strong. Alright. <sighs> what do we have? Let's use the power wave. Nah, he's a pushover. All he did was move. What the hell? Oh, maybe he has to get close to me. In which case, I'm gonna push him back. What's he gonna do? Uh oh. Ah, that was nothing. Let's power wave this guy. Alright. Uh. Yeah, just keep it power wave. One more to actually do it. In fact, I'll auto battle that one. There we go. That wasn't hard. Wasn't much experience, but you know. Damn it, I can't believe I let a Mongol get the better of me. But I swear, the Prophet will be. Yeah, yeah, that's enough out of you. You can shoot your mouth off in an interrogation cell. That was amazing, Stock. I'd never have guessed you were still on the mend. If you can handle your soul that well, you have no problem getting back to work. You were here? You didn't help me? God damn it! You guys are the worst backup ever! You handled it yourself just fine. We'll be waiting back at Heiss's office. Alright, I'll see you there. Okay, we revised it. Ah, oh, there you are, Stuck. Heiss is waiting in his office. Yeah, that's where I'm going. And that was a marvelous display you put on. You were watching? Freak. So what, what did we manage to ring out from him? Oh, yes, yeah, sure. you should know. They were hatching a plot to plunder the army's supply of explosives. <gasps> the shipment was originally meant to for use at Alma Mine. <gasps> I assume they have less safer intentions for the explosives. Well, the rebels are weak and few in number. We can easily foil their plots before they start. The real problem here is if the explosives don't reach Alma Mine. That's right, that's what was holding back Rosh, the Rosh Brigade in the other history. If the explosives don't reach their destination in time, the repercussions would be severe. And that's it in a nutshell. So, my task for preventing the heist? No, no, I've already sent an agent dealing with that. I had a more delicate mission in mind for you. Tell me more. I won't miss more- I won't mince words here. The mission stands a chance of putting an end to a long war against Grenorg. 
There's no one else I can trust with such a vital mission. No one but you, Stark. What's the objective? You will begin by heading to Grenorg. More than that, I can't say now. The situation changes hourly. Once the final order is given, you'll be contacted on site. It seems like a roundabout way of doing things, but such are the difficulties of the mission. Very well. To start, you'll have to update yourself with the current best way to enter Grenorg's territory. To that end, you'll liaise with our border contact at Lasville Hills. He's on another mission in Alma Mine right now, but he'll come back to Lasville Hills when he's done. If it's a simple border crossing, wouldn't we just pass through the Sand Fortress? I don't see the need to pick up any special intel for that. And if I told you that the Sand Fortress is on the verge of being recaptured by the enemy? Is it really? It's an old story now, with any border stronghold. We capture it, the enemy takes it back, and we reclaim it again in an endless cycle. Control of the Sand Fortress is too fluid to be reliable for this mission. Hence the need for the most current information, I see. You rendezvous with the contact under the bridge at Lesville Hills. Wait there, he'll come to you. Alright. Oh, and I said this earlier when we met in the medical facility, but you'll have those two along as your subordinates for this mission again. It's a difficult mission, and you'll need to work together to accomplish it. Looks like we're in the same boat again, Stock. Let's make this another success! Sounds good. We'll wait for you outside the castle. Please excuse us, Heiss. Mm-hmm. I'll be expecting as much as from you as I did before. We'll do our best to live up to your expectations, sir. Mm, ellipses. I suspect that in the course of your mission you'll learn the truth about this continent. Yeah, sorry, what was that? Is gathering info on that one of your objectives? No, but it would hardly be a waste of your time to find out. I expect once you know, you'll feel that it was better for you to have discovered it. That's something to look forward to. Hmm. That will be all. Prepare yourselves first, and then head to the bridge at Lasville Hills. Understood. Alright. Okay, guys, this is a good place to stop. We're going to continue this mission, and, you know, maybe we'll visit the previous history and see where that roadblock leads us, since I believe it now allows us to go forward, because we know what happened, right? We now know why the bombs didn't get there, which means we can prevent it. We'll find out next time anyway. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.